As an electric car, the e-Golf exclusively uses electrical power for driving. The new e-Golf offers even more. More power, more safety and more features. And this is decisive. 50% longer driving range. Its high voltage battery now stores even more energy. It offers a capacity of 35.8 kilowatt hours within the same mounting space. That is 11.6 more than its predecessor. This is possible thanks to new cell technology, improved materials with greater energy density and better utilization of cell volume. This now suffices for 300 kilometers based on a standard driving cycle. The practical range and relevant customer operation averaged over a year is around 200 kilometers, depending on driving style, outside temperature and the use of electrical consumers in the vehicle. Its electric motor now has an output of 100 kilowatts and applies an ample torque of 290 newton meters to the front wheels. The sprint to 100 kilometers per hour takes just 9.6 seconds. Despite more performance, the e-Golf is, as usual, very energy efficient at 12.7 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers. For efficient driving, it's important to utilize idling and regenerative braking at the right moment. The new eco-driving tips help there. Map data is used to give the driver specific tips on when to release the accelerator pedal and thereby save electricity. The Golf GTE is the plug-in hybrid of the sporty GT family. It offers a perfect combination of dynamism and efficiency, driving fun and sustainability. With two drives in one, a 1.4 liter TSI and a 75 kilowatt electric motor, which is located between the TSI and the DSG gearbox. They can work together or separately, depending on the situation. The GTE handles short trips, such as the way to work, with zero emissions by using its electric motor. In EV mode, the TSI remains shut off. This can be seen live in the cockpit. In GTE mode, or when spontaneous power is needed, the Golf GTE concentrates its forces and develops its maximum power. A full 150 kilowatts and 350 newton meters of torque. It reaches a speed of 100 km per hour in just 7.6 seconds, with an NEDC fuel consumption of just 1.6 liters per 100 km. As a plug-in, the GTE can be charged from electrical sockets and wall boxes at home or at public charging stations.